SDG 6 Clean water and sanitation The cleanup of oil spills helps ensure the availability of clean water in affected areas which is crucial for both human population and wildlife. SDG 9 Industry, Innovation and Infrastructure The development of advanced technologies such as ship and biodegradable materials promotes innovation and contributes to building sustainable and resilient infrastructure for managing environmental disasters. SDG 12 Responsible Consumption and Production The use of biodegradable absorbent materials encourage sustainable consumption and production by minimizing waste and pollution during the oil spill cleanup process. SDG 13 Climate Action by using renewable energy and automated system for oil spill cleanup, the project supports efforts to combat climate change by reducing the environmental footprint of traditional cleanup methods. SDG 14 Lies Below Water This project directly addresses the protection of marine life by minimizing the harmful effects of oil spills which threaten aquatic ecosystems. Hi everyone, this is our Oil Absorber Smart Ship. We built our dream ship and turn it into a reality by using AR, which is a rapidly developing technology today. This is the exterior of our oil absorber ship. Our ship uses solar energy as its power source or generator to drive the ship. Here is our smart map, which can accurately show the location to the AI on the ship. This is the most useful part of our ship, a trap or basket equipped with processed fibre that accidentally and effectively absorbs spilled oil. What is the project about? This project focuses on developing an automated system using ship and biodegradable absorbing materials to quickly and efficiently clean up oil spill in the ocean. What problem does it solve? It addresses the slow, inefficient and environmentally harmful method traditionally used to clean up oil spills, offering a faster and more sustainable solution. Who are the key stakeholders? Government agencies responsible for environmental protection and disaster management, marine and coastal communities that are impacted by oil spills, environmental organizations that focus on protecting marine ecosystems, technological developers and engineers working on smart ship and environmental cleanup technology. Who will benefit from this project? Marine ecosystems including fish and wildlife. Coastal communities depend dependent on clean waters for livelihoods, for example, fishing and tourism. Government bodies tasked with managing environmental disasters more effectively. Where will this project be implemented? Primarily in coastal waters and marine environments where all spills occur, such as near oil drilling sites, shipping routes or accident prone areas. It could also be tested in controlled environments like research facilities before full deployments in open water. Where can it be expanded? This system could be used globally in any region prone to oil spills, particularly in countries with extensive marine trade or oil exploration activities. When will the project be deployed? The project can begin with a research and development phase followed by pilot testing. Ideally, the technology should be operational during or immediately after an oil spill incident to minimize damage. When will it be most effective? It will be most effective during the early stages of an oil spill when the oil is still on the surface and before it spreads too far. Rapid deployment is critical for minimizing damage. Why is this project important? Oil spills are distrust for marine ecosystems, coastal economies and human health. Traditional cleanup methods are often slow, labor-intensive and harmful to the environment. This project uses cutting edge and technology to mitigate the damage quickly and more sustainably. Why will it succeed? It combines automation, innovation and environmentally friendly materials which provide a faster and more effective cleanup solution reducing the ecological impact and long-term economic cost of oil spill.
the fiber that absorbs oil will not be discarded. Instead, it will be sent to a laboratory for the process of separating the oil from the fiber. The separated oil will be processed into specialized petrochemicals or aviation fuel. The estimated financial returns are as follows. Specialized petrochemicals can reach between 8,427 Malaysian ringgit and 21,067 and 50 cent Malaysian ringgit per metric ton, depending on product application. Meanwhile, the price for jet fuel depends on the global crude oil price, with the current estimate ranging between 3,370 and 80 cent Malaysian ringgit and 5,056 and 20 cent Malaysian ringgit per metric ton. Both of these materials yield significant returns, thereby contributing to the economy and providing maintenance funding for our ship.